everyone, welcome to another Router Gods video. My name is Humphrey Chung and let's take a look at Texter. It's a free program, it's called T-E-X-T-E-R. And what it does is it helps you replace text with simple keystrokes. So if you have a long text, for example, let's go into Microsoft Word. And let's say a lot of times at the bottom of email, you type in your signature it looks something like this. You know, could be simple, could be elaborate and you have some type of phone number, you know, something like that, right? And of course your email address. Okay, so let's say that is at the bottom of all your emails. You don't want to type that in. Uh, of course, an alternative is you could copy paste from a lot of places, but what you want to do is you want to hit a couple keystrokes and have that automatically pasted in. Well, this is what Texture does. When you install it, it brings up a menu somewhat like this. And then you just click plus here to add a hot string. And it'll come up with this menu. Hot string, let's call it SIG, S-I-G. So when you type in S-I-G, it's going to put in that text for you. And in this box, you just erase what's there and type in your signature that you want. So we'll do that. RouterGods.com, God of the Known Universe. I type that very often. Okay, and then we'll put in some email, random email address, something like that. Bob at Bob.com. Uh, I'm going to guess there probably is a Bob at Bob.com, but, you know, oh well. And then we have different triggers that we could uh, select here. I'm going to uncheck Instant, and let's go through them. Do Enter. Let's see what happens there. Okay, so now my hot string is in there, in Texture. I'm just going to go to Microsoft Word here. Going to erase that signature right there. And let's type in SIG. You could see nothing happens, but as soon as I hit enter, that is replaced by text. That's pretty cool. Now you're probably wondering, okay, what if SIG is embedded in a word? So if I actually type in the word signature, well, Texture is smart enough to realize that you did not mean to type in your have it replaced by signature, so it lets that go. So in this case, because our trigger is at enter, it only takes effect when we hit enter. All right, so you're probably saying, well, that works great for Microsoft Word, but what about other programs? Well, we could try Notepad. And let me bring in Notepad here, SIG enter and the text is also replaced. So that's pretty nice. Well, for the router gods out there, you're probably wondering, okay, well, that's great if I want to do emails, but can I speed up my router configs and my router command line stuff? Well, you certainly can. We're going to click on the plus sign right here to add another hot string, and we're going to do something that will show our interfaces on a Cisco router. So it's going to be SIP, so short for Show IP Interface, or Show IP in PR. So in the text replacement box right there, we're going to do Show IP in PR, Show IP in PR, and we're going to have it do, in this case, Instant. Let's see what Instant does. So we'll click OK. You can see our SIP shortcut hot string has been added there and what instant does is as soon as I type in SIP that is replaced by show IP int BR now notice it did not hit enter for me so let's change that let's go back to our texture window show IP int BR I'm just gonna hit enter right after that click on save hot string we'll test it out by going back to Microsoft Word SIP and you could see it types in the, replaces your text and hits enter. It's pretty nifty. Let's make another one for a common command. Show IP route, S-I-R, sir. Okay, show IP route and enter. Let's also make it instant. Sounds pretty good. And let's make a really cool one, something that will configure OSPF for us. Or how about RIP? Let's do RIP. RIP sounds good. So hit the plus sign 
and the hot string we'll do is uh, do rip. How about that? And for the text, we're going to say router rip version 2, no auto network of all zeros. So that configures rip for us, and we'll make that instant. Okay, I think that's uh, probably about it. You always want to test things out inside of Word or Notepad just before you use this. Do rip, bam, router rip version 2, no auto, and network of all zeros. Okay, let's go into GNS3. We've got GNS3 and we've got a console window open. Let's move this console window over here. Okay, we're in the privilege mode. Let's do SIP, show IP NPR, that works. So all my interfaces are displayed, sir. Show IP route, I don't have any routes, so that's not a problem. Okay, let's say do rip. Ooh, do rip didn't work. Well, what happened here was because I wasn't in config mode. Okay, you see that? Was not in config mode, so not a problem. We'll just go back to texture, pop texture over here, and we just have to change a couple things here. Let's see what we could do. Do make sure we're in comp T. Comp T router rip version 2, no auto. This should make it pretty, pretty brainless. Save that out. And we could also make it, uh, take it one step further. Let's add an enable to that. Kind of dangerous, but let's see if that works. So now I am out of the router, get back in. I am in uh, user mode. Do rip, bam, and rip has been completely configured on my router. That is pretty, pretty nice. So that's a quick look at Texture. All it is is a pretty simple but very powerful to use text replacement tool. So we covered Enter, we covered Instant. As you can probably guess, these other triggers tab. So if you type in do rip and hit tab, then it will put in the text. Space is if you hit space after that. I probably I don't use space a lot. That's kind of dangerous because uh, you hit space a lot when you're just typing things out. I like enter and instant. And of course, you could have multiple triggers if you wanted to live dangerously, but I, I generally don't do that. All right, so that's texture. You can get it just by going to Google, typing in texture, and downloading it from Lifehacker's website. Thanks for watching.